A behind-the-scenes legal battle between special counsel Jack Smith and social media site Twitter, now known as X, over the account belonging to former President Donald Trump burst into public view on Wednesday. An unsealed U.S. appeals court opinion revealed Smith obtained a search warrant for Trump's Twitter account, and the company delayed complying. The opinion made public Wednesday affirmed a trial judge's decision to hold the social media company in contempt and fine it $350,000. The ruling said investigators had sought a non-disclosure order with the warrant, prohibiting the company from notifying Trump about the court-sanctioned search. In response, Elon Musk's social media platform raised First Amendment concerns and wanted to notify the former president, who is currently the frontrunner for the Republican presidential primary contest. In Wednesday's decision, the court said, quote, Under the circumstances, the court did not abuse its discretion when it ultimately held Twitter in contempt and imposed a $350,000 sanction. Trump, in a post on his social media site, Truth Social, said the Justice Department, quote, secretly attacked my Twitter account, making it a point not to let me know about this major hit on my civil rights. Prosecutors will often ask judges that targets of subpoenas issued in criminal probes not be notified in order to protect their investigations, a practice the appeals court cited in Wednesday's ruling. A spokesperson for Jack Smith declined to comment, and a spokesperson for X did not immediately respond to a request for comment. The attack on our nation's capital on January 6, 2021, was an unprecedented assault on the seat of American democracy. As described in the indictment, it was fueled by lies. Last week, Jack Smith criminally charged Trump for his alleged efforts to overturn his 2020 election defeat, which culminated in an attack by his supporters on the U.S. Capitol. A congressional investigation into that attack highlighted tweets by Trump encouraging supporters to attend a rally in Washington that day, exhortations of Vice President Mike Pence to illegally reject certain state electors, and in the midst of the attack, criticizing Pence for lacking the courage to change the outcome of the race. That last one was later deleted. While Trump's tweets are publicly viewable, the company also holds non-public information on accounts such as direct messages, drafts of tweets, location data, and the type of device used to send tweets. Trump pleaded not guilty to the charges in the 2020 election case, as he has so far two other federal charges alleging he illegally retained classified national security documents after leaving the White House, and state charges accusing him of falsifying business records to conceal hush money payments to an adult film star.